Pull Sign. Hello, my name is Cody Gamerun, and we're playing Minecraft: A True Love. I saw someone else on YouTube play this. I'm, I'm haven't, I didn't watch the whole video or whatever. I just know that's really fucked up and sadistic, and and it's weird. It's it's really weird. Don't judge me for playing this game, okay? Don't don't do it. All right. I, I, I. You wake up in a forest. Okay. That's nice. Now this is ad. I was just sitting at my computer playing Minecraft a second ago, and now I. Wait a second. This is. Holy shit! This is Minecraft. I'm in Minecraft. You decide to head over to the nearby cave to look for shelter. Yay! Arriving in the cave, you peek in but can't see much. Alright, this is about where I stopped watching. Well, no. Well, not, not, no. Never mind. Well, this is lame. I, uh, I can't see a damn thing. Let me try to get a closer look. I turn to lean in more. You end up falling in the cave. Well, nice job, buddy. Ow, my head. Great. I get magically transported into a dimension made out of blocks, and now I have a headache. Just when I think I'm having a good time, something always has to go wrong. Even in alternate dimensions. I know how that feels, man. <laughs> You don't uh, you don't notice the girl standing in front of you until she coughs, catching your attention. Oh, it's spider. Okay, this is where I stopped watching because I got scared that something bad was gonna happen. There's a guy, and a girl, spider, in the cave. And it's called Minecraft: The True Love. Uh, uh, it doesn't add up, right, man? Uh, may I ask what the hell you're doing in my cave, bish? I fell. Uh, what do I say to her? Uh, it's so hard to think with this pounding headache. Well, you shouldn't have fallen on your fucking head. Hey, I'm talking to you. Are you going to answer me or not? Bish? Oh, uh, sorry. I was just looking around and I kind of found your cave here. Hey, that sounds gross. God damn it, dude. Likely story. Well, if you're not, if you're going to be staying here for a while, I might as well tell you my name. My name is Spider. My family and I own, own most of the caves around here. What are you doing around these parts anyways? Like I said, I was just doing some exploring and kind of fell in. I was, wasn't meaning to do any harm. Well, okay. My parents aren't going to be home for a while. You want to get a little crazy? Oh, God. No. Beg your pardon? You kind of seem a little young, don't you think? Don't make fun of me. I'm 19, but I just look shorter than other people besides. You don't look too classy yourself. God damn it. I mean, we just met. I don't think we can get we really we can really get crazy. Hey, we can do whatever we want. It's not like there's any like there's really any laws or anything. God damn it, dude! Is it, this is going where I think it is? I'm not excited. I mean, if she is the age she says she is, I guess it wouldn't hurt to get a little comfortable with her. No, dude, no. 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 Uh, 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 dude, I just fucked a spider. I, I just fucked a spider. I fucked a spider. And it was pretty good, apparently. Oh my god. That, uh, damn it. Before you go, I just wanted to say, she paused for a second. Never mind, I'll see you around sometime. Yeah, fuck you. Well, that was exciting, <laughs> to say the least. As in, I wouldn't mind doing that again, maybe with a different girl. God damn fucking pig. <laughs> I don't get it, though. Why was she a girl in the first place? Every mob in Minecraft is made up of blocks while they're all anime. I guess this will describe her. As you ponder the question, you begin to start thinking, walking around in random direction. Looking up from your intense thought, you see you arrive in a swamp. How did I get here? I'm gonna fuck a pig. You hear a faint noise of something you can't describe in the distance. All you can tell is it's getting closer. You look around, trying to attempt to pinpoint the sound of the noise, but to no avail. You decide to sit next down to a tree and rest. After all, you did just have relations with a spider. God damn it. Bring up the spider again. Fuck me. Son of a bitch. You are awoken with a figure standing in front of you. That's nice. You can't make up much since it's standing in front of the sun. Either way, you attempt to interact with the figure. Hello? Who's there? 
Oh, God. We're gonna fuck a slime. Well, hello there, cutie. I haven't seen you around here before. Well, then, another one. This should be very good. Maybe I should as... Maybe I should be as weird as possible. See how much these girls will do. Well, hello there, beautiful. Looking good. Really? You think so? Hells yeah, your rack, I must say, is straight banging. <laughs> That's what I would say. <laughs> Why don't you get a closer look? Oh, god damn it. Maybe this is a bad plan. I'd love to. Say we go back to your place. Why did you... S oh, my fucking... Who said we can't do it right here? Oh, my god. No. No. Oh my god. Things get steamy. Oh my fucking god. I just fucked another. Sh I fucked a slime. Fucked a fucking slime, dude. Fuck. It was pretty great. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Swing by my say sometime if you want to do it again. I definitely want to see that nice rack of yours again. Oh my god. Walking through the sense passing which is not a sense. <laughs> oh my god. A hut. Found a hut. That's nice. And Jesus. It's probably a zombie. Hastily built. It looks built fine to me. Miss, would you want any help by any chance? Help me. Oh no, I'm fine. It is a zombie. Fuck. My fucking zombie. Are you sure you seem like you're a little distressed? You kneel down next to her, matching her gaze out into the ocean. It looks beautiful out there. She responds, ignoring your question. Well, bitch. Yeah, it really does. Have you ever wondered how it feels? What? The water? I, I know how water feels. You pause and look at her. She stares back at you. How what feels? Nothing, I'm sorry. What do you mean? Water's... No, it's alright. You can tell me. No, I'd rather not. We just met and I, Oh my god. She was talking about sex. Fuck. Fuck. Uh, fuck. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god. For what seems like hours, just talking, getting to know each other. Once she asks about you, you don't know how to respond. So where are you from exactly? Do I tell her the truth? Do I let her? When she blah 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 blah. blah. Dimension. You don't look. You don't look very on fire though. What? You said you're from a different dimension. You mean the Nether? Correct. Not. No, I came from a different world entirely. One not like this one. Well, a little, but not a lot. First of all, there aren't really people like you there. There isn't anyone like you, as far as I know. Everything in my world is built for us. Well, there's something. There's some who do the building, while others just live. She's been listening to your story the whole way through. Obviously fascinated by the idea. That sounds like a really weird world. Here, everyone has to either make do with what they have or go get it themselves. Is that what you have to do, or do you have a family that helps you? She stares at the floor. Something is on her mind. Are you okay? Was it something I said? I didn't mean to offend you. No, it's just that my family left me out a couple years back. I have been stuck living on my own. You take her hand gently. Oh, my fucking God. Fuck. Oh, my fuck. No. Fuck. Fuck. Starts to shift around. You glance over at her. She throws her arms around you and starts to get... Oh my fucking... 